Happening around the Ozarks now, Harmony House is kicking off its 10th annual eye care campaign, bringing awareness to domestic violence here in the Ozarks. Color 10's Bethany French attended their breakfast event this morning, and she's joining us live with more about the nonprofit and their mission. Yes, that's right. And Harmony House is the biggest domestic violence shelter in the state. And I got a chance to speak with one survivor who tells me that shelters like Harmony House can be life changing. We didn't have shelters. We had our church. We had um, hiding in families' closets. I just remember this so vividly. Dee Sova works for one of the businesses partnering with Harmony House through the eye care campaign. As a child, her father was abusive to her mother. As an adult, she was a victim herself. I got married to my children's father, who was later addicted to drugs, and so he started physically abusing me. And so um, I had to get out of that situation. So this cause, Harmony House, is so per personal to me. Um, I just want to give back in any way that I can. The eye care campaign takes place during Domestic Violence Awareness Month and encourages businesses and individuals to raise money and awareness. They pass out flyers for businesses to put up and start conversations with Ask Me Why I Care. You never know where somebody is going to come across these, uh, these signs, that hotline number, and say, you know, today's the day that I, I need to step up and do something or I need to call for help. It is going to get better, but you have to make the choice. It took me two years to leave my children's father. It was two years of planning, two years of, of knowing that life was going to get better if we just got out of the situation. Eye Care Awareness Day will be October 25th, and that's when you'll see lots of people wearing eye care pins, having people prompt them to ask them why they care. And if you're looking for ways to get involved with Harmony House, we'll have some more information linked on our website, ozarksfirst.com. Reporting live in Springfield, Bethany French, Color 10 News.